Moscow, exactly 30 years ago, October 2, 1993, Smolenskaya Square. On this day, against the background of the growing political crisis caused by the confrontation between the Supreme Soviet of the Russian Federation and President Yeltsin, a rally of supporters of the Supreme Council took place on the square. Riot police arrived to disperse the protesters. A mass brawl ensued with the use of improvised and special means. There were no casualties that day, but in less than a day the crisis will move into a phase of open armed confrontation. Supporters of the armed forces of the Russian Federation break through the blockade ring around the White House, seize the mayor's office and demand a live broadcast from the Austin Kino Television Center. As a result, according to official data alone, 158 people were killed and more than 400 injured on October 3 and 4. 